not only has the BAM situation, as well as the pandemic, put numerous halts on the release of Jackass Forever, but Peter, aka People for the Ethical Treatment of Animals, have taken a strong stance against the film and its producers for involving animals in some of their stunts. In fact, they are demanding that any scene involving an animal is immediately removed from the film. In a statement put out on the official PETA website back in July 2021, the president of the organization, Ingrid Newkirk, had this to say, Jackass stunts are violent and vulgar, but if the talent is willing and the wounds are self-inflicted, that's one thing however, it's quite another when animals are exploited, harassed, and harmed, that's cruelty. The Jackass Forever trailer shows Knoxville's crew provoking a snake and a bull to the point of attack, treating a tarantula like a game piece, and coercing a chained bear to eat honey off a bound participant. Peter is urging producers to remove stunts involving animals from the film. In a second press release posted to the Peter website only two months later, they claimed Jackass Forever broke state animal protection laws and filed a letter with the city and county prosecutors calling for an investigation and criminal charges against all those responsible. None of this, however, warranted any trouble or concern after all for the Jackass team, said Peter's most recent online statement. Despite hearing from Peter that scenes of animal exploitation normalize animal abuse, Jackass Forever has apparently refused to cut scenes. Read the 25th of January, 2022 statement. Sorry folks. <laughs>